Hello guys, welcome back again with me. In this video, I'm going to show you with React Native how to use function fit to access data from API. In the future, I will show you one how to list data from API. You see, here it list. And then I will show you how to delete data from API. And then I will show you how to create new. And the last one, I will show you how to edit data from the API. Here is the interface that I will need to show you with list, with delete, with edit, and new, okay? Let me uh, demo for you. So uh, here is list, and I want to create a record. I can click BTN new here. So it will pop up like that. And here is the form that we need to fill to sell data. We, we have a first name, last name, gender, telephone, email, and description. Here is the uh, information of teacher. So you can click, you can uh, import like, for example, Mr. John, Mr. John, okay. And mail, you can define one. So telephone uh, zero, uh, zero nine nine, for example, and email uh, John at uh, gmail.com. And description, he is a teacher. I see plus plus for simple. Okay, and then I sell. Okay. So you see, uh, here is uh, Mr. John in Butom. Mr. John, here is. Okay, Mr. John. Okay. Okay. And one more, uh, we can uh, take with remove. So if I want to remove here, I can click with the and re remove. You see, record is uh, now nine. So I want to remove again. Record is one. Okay, mean that uh, we remove data from database. Okay, and the last one we will uh, show you with edit. Uh, for example, I want to edit an information. I can click this record. I uh, by click BT and edit, and it will show data in the form, and we can edit. So I want to change our uh, email. So Miss C, Miss C uh, at gmail dot com and save. So we can edit, so here is uh, information how I change edit uh, Mr. Missy, right? Okay, uh, let's start now. Okay, we can uh, back to okay, our code. Okay, so we can go to uh, app.js here. Okay, let me start now. We can the first one we can import React from re React. Second, we can import some component from React Native library. We can say we can write like that from uh, from re React Native. Okay, we can use a uh, call component tag component a uh, software component. Software component, software view, sorry, software view. We can call view and scroll view, scroll view, okay, and take style, sorry, style sheet, yes, yeah, style sheet. Okay, so I, after that, we can uh, create main function call con app equal, yes, and read. Return. I define web container with a uh, software view, software view, and close track. Okay. 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 And I can write with a simple text called picture list, picture list, and control, control S. Okay. And in below, we can define style, declare style, con by con style. Letter S equals style sheet dot create create okay and you can define style in this okay for example tt main okay I define font size font size font size dot uh, sixty yes sixty pixel sixty okay and font width bold bold. And we can call style, style, property style equal style with letter S dot 
T T main. Okay. So we can go to terminal and uh, type command line with nph react netils runs isos. Okay. Don't forget export default app. Okay. Export sorry export default app. Okay. Export default app. So we will list the tab from ABI. We will remove and create and update by using React Native with fix function to access the tab from the ABI. Okay, now it's compiling. Okay, it's successful. So it will run app okay, in simulators. Okay, this we call simulators, simulator, virtual simulator. Yes. You can see teacher list. Okay, this is uh, the uh, output. Okay. I put after that we can uh, implement in uh, app.js we can uh, create a function to require data from the api first okay i can create con with function get leaf okay get leaf feature for example okay we call our arrow function right arrow function and this i uh, am um, this 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 uh, file i'm right in hooks react hooks okay and uh, here is uh, the function that we will to uh, request data from the API. So I will use fix function uh, like I as you like I tell you. So uh, we can call fix f a t c a, okay, and define the URL of the API. Okay, URL of the API. We have here is the API get list, get list teacher with HTTP uh, Node.js cost g two dot version dot app slash API slash teachers. When I click on uh, BTN Sun, so it will respond data like you see. Yeah. Okay, here is list list uh, list teacher. So I can copy this uh, API and pass to request in our app. Okay. And the second parameter is the option like we have a method. So what method that we need to pass to request? So this API designed with method get. So we can uh, pass method get. Okay, and then uh, we can call a function then, okay? Then, and then rest. So we need to return rest.json, rest.json. Okay, after that, then again, okay, then again. So a uh, rest again, and uh, you can uh, console.log, okay, with uh, respond, with respond, right? Okay, and of to that we can uh, define cuts if a uh, it has some error okay here yeah, error we can console here also console dot lock show dot lock yeah error so we have defined function is already this. this function is a use fake function to require data from the api here is the url to request data from api that we call the teacher so and we need to pass method get to request uh, data from the APIs. Okay, so uh, we can call the function with use effect. So uh, we need to call use effect function from react. We can come and call use effect from react. Use e effect. So we can call this function in block app function and uh, you can define like that. Okay. And with the empty array, so we can call function getly teacher here by pass function name, okay, like this. Okay, so okay, and then uh, we can run again, run uh, with a simulator. So I uh, npx react native runs iOS. So I uh, when the file is shoot, it will call it out from the API. I, I will debug for you, okay, why by I uh, click in simulator and you can click. Uh, control command Z, it will to go like this with a uh, reload. You want reload, you want debug, you want show and speak. Uh, this is both for reload, configure bundle, or, or so a preference monitor or concern, right? So, what you prefer, you can click. So, I will debug for you uh, to lock the data that respond from the API. I can click again with control command Z, okay, and click debug with Chrome. Debug with Chrome. So I, uh, you see, okay, in a uh, Chrome you can, I, uh, okay, inspect right, inspect, okay, 
and go to tab console. Okay, go to tab console and clear. Okay, and in app, you can uh, reload by click or letter or and letter or. Okay, letter or. So you see, here is a data that respond from ABI. I have control the lock. Okay, respond with the list. Okay, list is the array object that respond from the ABI. You see? Okay. It has egg, egg record, right? Yes, egg record. So I go back again. Okay. If you want to stop the bug, you can click again. Control command Z, it will to go and stop the bug. Okay. So mean that respond is uh okay, is again get data from the API with list. So uh, we can declare state to get the task, okay, to, to store data in uh, our project. So we can con declare state. I uh, can still uh, declare state list, okay, and then set list like this and uh, with a uh, function use state. So we need to import just that again from React. Use just that, okay, use that. I write in hook, so I uh, use that is the function that uh, provides us to create state in React. So uh, in this, uh, we can initial input array. Okay, here is that name, here is the terms. Okay, after that, I will uh, in this list. So I check if rest, if rest. Okay, I, I will set list. Okay, set list with a rest on rest dot list. Rest dot list. Okay, rest dot list. So a uh, list is will uh, get the data from the API store in this variable state. So I can use this uh, list variable instead to show in our component. I can uh, display in this, and I would like to uh, display list dot length. Okay, list dot length means that it return length of array object. So I make sure what the length of array that respond. Okay. So you can see it's nine, right? Okay, nine record. Okay, nine record. So mean that the data is respond from the API already. So like you say in Postman, okay. After that, I will render it like the list. So we can use a component scroll with you, right? Scroll with you. So I need to import scroll with you. I have import already scroll with you component from React Native. Mean that I make a even data is a lot more than, uh, more than 20 record. It will make a scroll, right? Yes. So I need to render list, okay? I by by define here list dot map and item index, okay? And return, return, okay? And define wrap container with view, okay? And define text component and display uh, item by like this item dot dot key that we want to uh, get okay? to show. We have first name, right? First name. Uh, why I know because of uh, the time that respond of of API, it returned this key. You can go back to Postman. You see, here is the first name. So I want to show first name. I can define item dot first name, and don't forget uh, define property key here with uh, index. Okay, index, index. So 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 if we go back to simulator, you can see first name. Okay, all first name here, right? Okay. So I will I uh, design okay design for you. I like to be pass okay. We have last name, last name. We have a gender. We have telephone. We have the email, and we have description. This description I can copy pass. Or oh, if if we make we not so we can copy pass, copy and paste okay description. So right. Okay, here the data from the API. Okay, like you see. Okay, here scroll with you. Eh? Okay, here scroll you. If you don't find scroll with you, mean that we cannot make a scroll in our simulator or our device. Uh, so, okay, you you cannot scroll. Okay, okay. So we need to define scroll component. Okay, wrap in our render list. So it's make us a uh, can scroll uh, to see uh, other item, right? Okay. So I need to define a, a style here. Uh, Scroll view, I can uh, define style here with a uh, style equal container style, sorry, container style, container, content, content, content style with a uh, uh, padding, padding, padding horizontal, left and right, okay, 
sunrise. Can you see? Okay, and uh, he is also uh, he also paying paying tons. Okay, he T man. Uh, okay, paying tons. Okay, you see, and after that, I will define sty in this view with sty equal sty dot item. Okay, sty dot item. Okay, I can define sty in our component sty with a uh, item. Okay, and define a uh, padding, a uh, padding vertical. Top and bottom, turn right. Okay. What it is? Okay. I uh, style dot items. Okay. We wrong. We wrong. Okay. Wrong right boss. Style dot item. You see? Okay. I after that I can define border bottom, border bottom width. Okay. One pixel and border bottom color. Border bottom color. What color I define? Like this. Okay. You can see here is our item, okay. first name and last name. So we want to change a first name in, first name and last name is the same line. You can do like that, okay. Okay, first name and last name. And gender, uh, the data from the API, it's, re it's return one and zero. So, okay, it's one mean that male and zero is female. So I can uh, define condition like this. If gender equal one, Okay, uh, if uh, gender equal one, I will define a uh, letter so so uh, male and then female. Fem, female. Okay, okay, you see, male or fem, female. So if you want to make style here, you can okay, make style also. Style with letters, style letter S dot. Sorry. Style dot tt 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 not more, not more. Okay, and I specific this a first a name tt name. Okay, I will define some style. TT name with phone with phone size phone size sixty and phone width phone width bowl okay you can see okay and TT no more T it T mean a tick tick not more. You can define style uh font size font size okay and color color of text you can define this color okay you see is our data the display from the uh, that that they respond and display from my API. Okay. So then we list you can list data from the API. Okay, you can see. And after that, I need to uh, create more action with our uh, remove, create, and delete. So I need to uh, create button. Delete and edit first. Okay, so I can define here. Okay, with the wrap container again, view, and then we have view again. Okay, in this, okay. I need to create button. I can define torch opacity, torch opacity, and we can define touch. With a uh, delete, okay, delete, delete, okay, and I uh, start here. We can on press, on press, okay, handle, re remove, 
Okay, and the move we can copy this function and to declare the top of function return. Okay, con handle remove. Handle remove. And handle remove, we need to uh, define function like path parameters. So we can say like that. Okay, with a row function and pass parameter to this function when we handle click this button. Okay, this button. So we can pass item. Item, no? Okay. Handle delete. So we can style here. Style. Style dot t t d delete. So we can write, we can define style t t delete. Okay. T T D delete. Okay. And color red. Okay, color red. You can see? Color color. Red. And you need to define style more with a style below. Style equals style dot row. Row between. Okay. Row bit between. Okay. Row between. I can define like this. Okay. Uh, with the top <clears throat> display click okay display direction okay sorry uh click direction row row okay and uh, justify content okay uh, space between space between okay and we can remove here remove this one okay and then save again. You can see uh, here is both BT and delete, okay, that I have defined in here. Okay. So when we click, so we will handle or remove this data from API. Okay. okay. So now we can start with handle or remove, okay, handle or remove. So handle or remove it pass parameter with item, okay, item so. To start, we need to integrate API fix again, okay, with uh, to remove data from the database. You can go to Postman, you will see your API remove here. So here is API remove, and we need to pass method delete, and here is parameter with body JSON with a key teacher ID, and here is the ID that we want to remove from the database. Remove from API, okay, so we can pass this like this. So I can copy this API. And then start with fit function again. Fit, okay, this API and with method re remove. Sorry, method del delete. Okay, and pass property then. Pass property then. Okay, property then, and we can find rest. Rest dot return return rest dot JSON, and then again, then again. Rest. Read okay. We can uh, console a lock okay, or we can get list again okay. Get list again, this one. When it's success okay, we can get list again, okay. And uh, if you have some catch, you can uh, handle cut function error. <coughs> Console dot lock. Yeah, error. Okay, error. Okay, let with this. So we uh, we need to we need to pass parameter with a body JSON. So we can comma and with uh, more of the uh, property uh, path to API. We can define with body body and uh, you can uh, you need to define a uh, a JSON dot stringify okay stringify like this and i pass the task to api with a property teachers with a teacher id right okay like this teacher i id okay here teacher id okay so with id is static so we want to dynamic we need to get data from a parameter here with item dot id Item dot ID, what ID? Teacher ID, okay. Teacher ID, because our item is the object that it has. It has an ID with teacher ID property. You can see in list, okay, here. 
teacher ID. So we, we need to uh, pass property teacher ID. Mean that we get all teacher ID that uh, the client side has clicked. Okay, teacher ID. And it will pass to the uh, API server. So it will remove uh, with specific this ID. Okay, and after that, it will get list again. So if uh, it works, mean that uh, our record will lose. Okay, go back to our app and click BTN lead. So before we need to reload by click letter or. <clears throat> now we have uh, nine record, nine record, right? So nine record. Okay, we need, uh, we forget property key. Key. Uh, here. Okay, reload again. Okay, now we can start with a uh, handle remove. So if we click remove, it will process this API to remove data from uh, database okay, by uh, using this API. Okay, so I can click uh, the top of the objects with a John Cena. I, I can remove, delete. Okay, what's the error? Remove, right? Remove. So it's not worldwide. So we, we can control the lock with the what's errors, okay? Teacher, the teacher ID. Mm -hmm. Delete, okay, method delete. Okay, it works, method delete. And body, okay, body that is Uh, We can uh, debug again, okay, try to debug what's error. Okay, we debug with Chrome and you can go to Chrome and reload. Okay, and clear with, uh, you can click BTN remove. Okay, BTN remove. Uh, BTN remove. Why? It's not a fit. Okay, again. Uh, Console.lock. Okay, you can see, see here. Uh, uh, Console.lock. Uh, respond again. Again, okay. respond again. Okay. Reload. Okay, and uh, click BT and remove. Okay, okay, we see the errors. Uh, error is a uh, teacher ID required. Teacher ID required. Why? Teacher ID required. Mm -hmm. Okay, it cannot uh, catch with uh, property teacher ID. Okay, so method uh, delete. Okay, method delete. Okay. Teacher ID requires. Okay. Again. For example, I pass a uh, teacher ID like this. Again. Teacher ID require mean that API cannot uh, catch, okay, cannot uh, get a uh, property teacher ID. So maybe we miss something. So we will check uh, with uh, the function. So which, okay, which I can go to browser and we search uh, which uh, API. Okay. Uh had the request. Had the okay, had the mm, we can just had the wait, wait. delete, okay. Method delete. Content high. Uh, react native, react uh, native, which, which post, I uh, click uh, delete, click delete method, okay. Delete success.
I I let me test with uh, this. Wait, uh, sorry. We post, okay? We post. I see that we need to pass the headers to our function with a header keys and with a key with a key a sub and content type application JSON and application JSON also. So we can copy this uh, this object pass in our function. Okay. Here. Okay. Let uh, me start again. Headers. So reload. Okay. Okay. It uh, error. We can run again. Okay. We can run again. We but the first one we can close terminal. Close terminal. And uh, you can kill and run again. Okay. And run again. So you need to wait. <coughs> Okay, now it's run. Okay, and we will test again with a function remove. Now we have nine records, and I click this and the remove. Okay, you see uh, now it's a uh, only eight. Eight record means that it remove one record already. So, I uh, totally I mean that if you want to uh, pass uh data like JSON object to our API, you need to define header like this. Okay, with a sub key and content type and the value it you can define your application JSON okay you can note this function right okay you see uh, I remove again container you see or reload okay remove uh, remove remove Remove, remove. Why it not work? Oh, because uh, I pass a uh, uh, ID static, right? ID static because of uh, this ID no uh, is no available in our database. So we can uh, pass dynamic with uh, item dot teacher ID. Okay, again, sorry. Okay. Reload and click remove. Remove, remove, ah, okay, remove, okay, remove, okay, you see, okay, so now it works, right, okay, with function re, remove, so now we have only four, four record, okay, four record, so now we are done with the feature remove, you can uh, summary already, you can summary with the feature uh, uh, function remove, so we need to use switch function and a class a URL that we want to remove and we method uh, delete so and body we need to uh, use a JSON simplify to convert right with the uh, object that we pass to API so uh, for using uh, this function we need to uh, pass a JSON that simplify and pass object that we want pass to server and don't forget pass uh, this object also with a uh, header okay with, with header object uh, you can pass uh, a sub Okay, application JSON and content type. And then this uh, rise, okay. After it's success, we will get it again, okay. So now we uh, we done with a uh, feature remove, okay. Feature remove. Now we can continue with a uh, feature create. So I can create button new in this one, right? BTN new. I can 
right here I put opacity and with let it take with take and the entire new new texture okay new okay new so I can uh, put red container u style equal style with letter s dot row between okay row between row between is the style I have defined below already in style block okay okay and we can define property on press on press equal and or create create Create. And I create. I can define here. Con and I create. Okay. Like this. Okay. So you see, uh, BTN new, right? BTN new. Okay. BTN new. You can style with a uh, BTN new also. Style equal with a uh, padding ten. Okay, padding ten. Heading 10. Okay, you see? Yeah. And with color blue. Blue or phone with bold. Okay, sorry. Uh, color blue. Color mean that uh, we need to pass with a uh, proper with style text here. Okay, style. Colors. Blue. Phone with. Bold. Okay. Here. And on click. So on click, he block off on click. So on click, it will handle create. So we need to uh, uh, start with a uh, create API here. But uh, we need to create form or uh, form to provide client input data, data first, right? Like first name, last name, gender, email telephone description also. So we need to create a form for a client side to import data, okay? So I, I need to create a model component model. So when uh, we click BTN new, so I will pop up model and uh, then I will define of a uh, take import, okay, to user, okay? So uh, I can define model. So I can define in uh, this component, but in this component, okay, and if with model, Sorry, model. Model. So we need to import model from React Native also by command call model. Model with the component that a lower for pop up. So we can call this component that is available in React Native model. I will show you one by one model pass here. Okay. And in models, we can uh, define a properties. Uh, we can define object. Okay, text. Okay, for example, I test. Okay, test more model. Test model. Okay, copy. Okay, and then in model, we have some property with visible. Visible, the value of visible property can be true or false. So if true, it will pop up, or it will close, right? Okay, and we one more, uh, we can. Uh, uh, by default, we can test with a property true, true. You see, uh, it will pop up and over our screen. Okay, if I define false, it will close. So if we we, we know uh, the feature, you can create a state for to manage this model. I can declare I uh, go to top. I uh, declare one state more with a uh, visible con. I uh, like a uh, model teacher, for example model teacher okay and set more model okay teacher teacher okay and define you state by default I will define it state uh fall while you it, it for race and we can use this uh, state to pass in our component with property visible by pass state model teacher so it can be true or false so true, one true, one I went through. So I with with a user click uh BTN new, I will define set visible teacher true. Set uh model visible teacher, model teacher true. Okay, true. 
So mean we click this uh, BTN button, it will pop up. And so we need to define a uh, uh, action more with close. So I can define here view, and then uh, we text define title new teacher, and one more I can define a uh, with total capacity, and with text close. Okay, close. Close, and we can define of uh on press, on press. I uh, we can uh, handle this. The function handle close, handle close, model, model. So we can copy this function and define here on handle close model. So what we need to do in the function, we just set model teacher to fall. Okay, done. Like this, and we can define style with a uh, style. We can we have one style. Okay, with the style uh, dot, I uh, row between. Okay, row between. Okay, and then when I uh, the, the user click close, it will close model. For example, you can see uh, I click with the new will pop up. So and then uh, I need to click close, but close now it uh it have uh here. So we in a, in a click style. So we can define one property more with soft area view in our container in model. Soft area view. Okay. Soft area view here. Okay. You see? Okay. Soft area view. We use again new and close. New and close. Okay. You see? Okay. New and close. Nah? New and close. Okay. Oh, teacher and new teacher okay so uh, we can uh, override style more like this with uh, with padding padding horizon horizontal okay turn you can see okay padding horizontal turn and then you can define with a uh, style dot uh, equal a uh, style dot close tt close right so you can uh, copy the style and write in our style below uh, with uh, style close, tt close. Okay, and I would like to read a uh, 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 color, but color, gray. And one more font size, okay, 16, and then font with bold. Okay. Like this, okay, and I can uh, define the same with a uh, tt teacher. Uh, style dot new teacher style dot. okay. Style dot tt close, okay, with the same. So in this uh, one, we will design uh some tick input, okay, close. Close new close, okay. Let's start now. We can uh, start in this block with create tick import. Okay. Okay. Uh, for example, uh, we have uh, some import like uh, we call import component. So we need to import component also in React Native with import. Text in import. Text import a component like I uh, make a uh, text import that allow to uh, to a uh, okay rise in input okay go here and pass this one we take input okay pass okay so and then uh, we can define style with a uh, style dot text take in input okay style take input take input so i will uh, copy this style to Right here. <clears throat> First one are padding. Okay, padding 10. Okay, border 1 and border color uh, by this color and then uh, matching top 10. Okay, 
So it's area with a property border, border width, okay, border width, three, and border color. color. You can see here, uh, here is the, uh, uh, take import the house uh, design, okay. And let's start, uh, I need to define a container one again with uh, this block, with the view, okay. In the view, I need to define padding horizontal. Okay, padding horizontal. Style equal uh, padding horizontal. Padding horizontal with 10. Okay, again. So we can see. Okay, and I go back again with uh, this thick input. I need to change uh, matching with home. Okay, matching with with home. Okay. Okay, go back. I uh, in this uh, top of the thick input, I need to define title text with a okay, uh, we can say first, first name, first name, right? First, first name, you see, first name. Okay, and any, and here matching top, matching top, twenty. Okay, we have first name. Okay, we have first name, and then a uh, last name. First import. Okay, first name and last name. Here, yeah, you see? Okay, first name and last name. New close. Okay. Okay. You see, right? So I uh, we can start declare what's a uh, right board that we need to declare for is uh take input. So uh, we can copy and paste. <clears throat> Again, uh, first name, last name, gender, okay, gender, and then uh, email, telephone, okay, telephone or email, telephone, telephone, and email. And the last one, description, right? E email email and then description this description okay description you see uh, we have like this need to reload again new okay we have first name last name gender uh, telephone, email, and description. Okay. So what did we do more? We uh, we need to start the clear state. Okay, to get the data from uh, user input chain, right? So what's that that we need to declare? We can count input one, two, three, four, five, and six. So we need we need to declare a first name state, last name state, gender state, telephone state, email state, and description state. So we need to declare six that, right? So let's start. First one, on. First, first name, set, first, first name. Okay, use that. By default, we need to initial this value to empty string. And last name is the same, last, Last name and set last name. Last name. And then gender. Gen, gender, set. Set gen, gender. Okay, and just set gender. By default, I need to define zero. Zero, okay. And again, with uh, telephone, uh, set telephone, set telephone. Okay, we can define empty string. And email. E email set email set e email so you set in the string and the last one is description description okay and set description set this this description okay set description so now we have the declare six state already 
So what is the uncheck? We need to use this state, right? So for example, uh, if we can go to this uh, component on, okay, tick, uh, tick input, we have uh, uh, even on chain, on chain tick, on chain tick, okay, on chain tick. So we can uh, write like this, okay. And then uh, set, uh, set uh, here is the tag, tag, and then we can uh, set, okay, uh, set first name. So call state of, call what's that, set first name. Set first name with a uh, text, with text, right? Okay. And don't forget with value, we need to define value also. Value equal that state, mean first name, state. Okay, don't forget. Okay, let me step one, uh, go here, on chain. Okay, now it works. So we can copy and paste with the other component. Okay, and if you want to define placeholder, it's okay. For example, placeholder with a uh, first name. Okay, for example. So I can copy these uh, keys and pass two other. I repeat last name. Okay, and uh, value last name. And set, set last name. Okay, set last name. And gender, so the same. Okay, copy pass and uh, gender. Gender and uh, on chain, I mean that gender, gender, and after that, set gender, set gender, okay, set gender. Okay, and telephone, test. Okay, we can uh, define telephone play holder and while you telephone state and setter is set, set telephone, set telephone. More, uh, email. Okay, with our email, emails, and set email, set e, email, and for don't forget with our email state, yes. Okay, the last one with a description. Okay, we can uh, copy description in play holder, and state is description, and I uh, set her is set description. Okay, now I have to define all these set. Description, value descriptions, okay, and play holder. Okay, and let us save and, okay, you see? Here, yeah, you see? Okay. I close and I need to reload again. Okay, let a new, click new and you, you see first name, last name, gender, telephone, email, and description. Okay, gender, I, I have designed one zero, so, I didn't uh, create checkbox, so I can uh, I can define, I can input one or zero, okay, you understand? And after that, we input in string. So first name, last name, gender, e email, telephone, is the string, right? So uh, now we can test, okay? Our uh, first name, with, uh, for example, uh, G, I, uh, Sok, okay? Bona, Sok Bona, okay? Uh, gender one, mean that mail and telephone zero, Nine nine email uh bona at gmail for example okay at g gmail and description stu student and then uh, after we on chain this tick input we need to uh, define uh, some button and make the client side click to sell so we need to uh, create button sell also so I need to create one more button with uh, in this okay and can call Toy opacities, for example, toy opacity, toy opacity, okay, and pass. I define with a uh, cell, title cell, cell new, cell, okay, cell. Okay, I, and we need to uh, define a hand dot cell, okay, hand dot cell. Okay, and we can write style here with style equal with uh, style i uh, dot btn container for example container so I copy this uh, style to write some okay. 
I would like to read uh, border, border width, one, and uh, padding, ten, okay, and uh, border color, border color, border color, gray, okay, and go back. I with uh, on press and our sell, so I need to copy this function and to process. I to sell okay that okay. Con and the sale. Okay, and the sale. So uh, this is the stuff that we need to pass uh, the the value of the state that uh, user on chain in this form to the API. So I have API uh sale already. You can uh, back to postman with the API sale or create. So uh, he is uh, API create and is the parameter that we need to pass to API and we need to parameter post so we can copy this API first. Okay, it's uh, the same with the uh, API remove need. API remove here, so I can copy this and pass with the uh, end of sale. So I need to change with the uh, API remove here, API remove and pass uh, here. So, sorry, uh, API create, so API create, okay, and pass it here. And I need to define method post. Okay, method post. Okay, and the key is the same, but a parameter we need to change. So the parameter to create a new teacher, we need to need a same key like first name, last name, gender, telephone, email, and this can and this comes in like I I saw you uh, in the form that we create. So I can copy and pass this key. Okay. Okay, but. First name value, last name value, gender, telephone, email, and description. So we need to get from our state. So we need to get from uh, the first one with a uh, first name state, second last name state, last name state, a uh, uh, gender state, a uh, telephone state, a okay, telephone state, and email state, email state, and last one is description state description state okay done okay uh, after uh, it's success uh, we can uh, call get list again so let me start now but uh, after uh, in, in success uh, we should uh, close model also so we can uh, uh, call function set uh, model a uh, teacher equal fall okay for pass, pass the value to our state feasible form in that uh, after success it will close model okay let me start now, go to our simulator and uh, uh, you can test now. Reload. Okay, reload. And now we have four records. So I need to create one record or one teacher. So I click with the new, it will pop up model. And I define uh, with static, I uh, Mr. I uh, Missy. Okay, gender one. Okay, and telephone zero nine nine email. Okay, I don't pass. Description, I don't pass. And I click with the unsell go okay you see uh me see here create right mr me me see okay me see you can you can see okay i create so i can i i modify some style a red 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 for me uh in this btn container i will background border color or the, i can define background color uh background color red black sorry black and then uh i take a line center to line uh, center send center or uh, justify content center so let's miss that okay uh justify content center justify content center click a line a line item center Okay, here is a BTN re a BTN cell, right? So let me test again. Reload. I want to create new teachers. I click BTN new. And here's first name. Like uh, Mr. John. Okay. Mail. Telephone. Zero eight eight, for example. Email John at gmail.com. Description he's a teacher. I see plus voice in Paul. I click BDN sale. So 
Okay, you see here is uh, the information that we have to uh, uh, pass to API and to sell new teachers. Mr. John, mail and telephone, email and description. Okay, let me again, new. Okay, here. Okay, and you need to modify Mr. Sok. Okay, and I. Uh, more so okay and then zero okay and then i uh, pass telephone and then gmail gmail we need to find so at gmail.com go okay. uh students for simple so okay here's uh data that we have to sell to uh, a server okay So to sell a uh, uh, sell student a uh, sell a uh, teacher, so we can call this API and I uh, pass method box, and you need to use a function uh, JSON that signify with this object that part to the server need to uh, create. So we require this uh, object and then don't forget pass with our headers. Okay, after it, it, it's a success, I call function get list again and it will remove data from the database. Okay. Okay, is uh you see, and now we have done with a feature create. So uh, when we are uh, new again, so we can uh, see information less history. So if you want to clear, we can find create function one uh, clear form. Okay, con uh, clear form. Clear form. So I, I can I clear, I set by call function set first name to image string, okay. Okay, and function uh, set last name to image string and set gender to one, set gender. And then uh, set email to image string and set telephone in the string and set description in the string. Okay. Done. So we can call clear form when uh, our data self success. Okay. Here. Clear form. Okay. Now we have done with the features. Uh, features. Uh, okay. We knew we can see our clear form already. And then uh, now we can uh, continue with feature A edit. So we need to create more BTN. For example, we want to edit this record. We click a B BTN and then uh, it will pop up and we can modify. So when we save, in that we, we update data. Okay, so now let me start feature up, update. Okay, feature update, you can go here with a near BTN lead. I can copy past one button. You can modify with a title edit. Okay, and function we need to change a handle, handle edit. Okay, handle edit and copy this function and to declare the top of function return by call ID, handle the edit. And handle edit, so mean that uh, we need uh, to pass uh, the item that we click to our state and our state we are so in uh, the input. So it pass item, so I can call like this, okay, like this. So with uh, item, first one, item dot, dot what, dot uh, first name, okay, item dot last name, uh, item dot gender, dot gender, uh, item dot uh, email, uh, me again, uh, item dot, Telephone item dot description. Okay. And then we need to declare a state one with uh, uh, the ID. So when we edit, we need to store with the ID that we, uh, we click. So I, I need to declare one step more uh, with uh, teacher uh, underscore ID. And you can shut teacher ID, you can declare like this, it finds, okay, teacher ID, and 
but we did we need to set a teacher id also teacher id with item dot teacher id okay and clear we need to clear teacher id also teacher set teacher id to to now right really, to now so teacher id we need to uh, before now okay now okay so done <coughs> So uh, now let me test with uh, if I click edit. So edit now it a uh, wrong style. Really it should not uh, color red. So I can change style here with uh, tt edit tt new okay tt uh, e edit edit okay. and I need to uh, to define uh, some style. Okay, I need to change color or move color. Can be blue colors. Blue. Okay. So can we test now with uh, when I click BTN edit? So if you pop up, so in now it not pop up because of I forget with class function set visible teacher true. So we can set or set model visible teacher to true value. So, okay, go, edit. Okay, not work now, edit. Okay, why it does not sound okay? Let me check again, handle edit. Handle edit, it has item, so uh, with item, I call item dot already, why? And the ID. Let me test with uh, item dot ID alert using alert with uh, alert item dot teacher ID. ID. Okay, this ID has already. Okay, teacher IDs. I uh, teacher ID item dot first name. Oh, first name is not correct. Last name. Item dot first name. Okay, John. Okay, now it works, right? Okay. Okay, let's see again. Oh, I clicked. I saw this information. Edit. You see, Mr. John, gender. Okay, uh, telephone, email, and teacher. Okay, I click this record. Okay, uh, Dragon. Okay, Dragon. Okay, so, so I, when we, which, when I, when we, we know, I, Update or I uh, save. So I uh, I have to uh, with the flag function teacher ID. So if uh, I did, I need to define with uh, teacher ID has value. But if I uh, create new teacher ID is now, so I can use uh, this parameter this uh, step to check this condition. Okay, so, uh, when we click BT and sell, mean that we update. So I can uh, check this uh, condition with if uh, teacher ID equal. For now, mean that uh, it's sell new, right? And L mean that it, it did. Okay, so we need to uh, check this condition. If teacher ID equal now, mean that sell new. And if not now, mean that we update so i need to change uh, api to put method to put and parameter we need to pass one with uh, parameter teacher id you can go to postman see here is uh, api edit so the parameter we need to pass teacher id and the data we want to modify uh, our property or our column okay so we need to parameter with teacher id and don't forget pass a uh, teacher id state teacher id here okay I think uh, like this uh, enough. Okay. Let's start. Uh, reload. Okay. I want to edit uh, the top of. Uh, I know I want to edit this data with a uh, data con. I, I click edit, and I need to uh, data to to go go. Okay. I save. 
You see? Go, go. Go, go. Okay, to a uh, no, no. And a uh, telephone. Uh, one, one, one. Quite simple. Okay, and email. I uh, go, go. Go, go. At gmail. Gmail.com. Okay. This caption is a teacher. C sap. Okay. Go. Okay, you see here but he his uh, information that we have to on chain already. So totally I have to show you already with all the feature. The first feature we need to I, I have show you with list a uh, list I uh, data from ABI with teacher list. And second, I show you with uh, action remove, delete. And I uh, then I need to create model with a feature create new teacher and then with a uh, feature edit. So I, I have to show you already this group mean we have create, update, delete. Okay. And create news. Okay. 